Okay, day 25, eating on the starch solution. And it was a good day. I started working today. So this is like when I start into my project, it gets to be like a challenging situation usually, but not today so much. It didn't feel challenging. I woke up, I had oatmeal and raisins. I found some raisins in the house and I was happy to do that and some green tea. Later in the morning, I had some cantaloupe. And then uh, as time went on, I wanted to have like a Mexican dish. I didn't think I had any corn in the house, but I remembered I had two corn on the cobs that I had never cooked. So I steamed them up and I was taking the corn off the cob to put into the Mexican, di Mexican dish, but the corn was so delicious that I just ate two ears of corn and it was really good. And no butter, you know, like usually when I, historically, when I think about corn on the cob in the summer, I'd always think about it with melted butter. But the reality was it, it was just great without any, and I never even thought about it just till now. And uh, then I made the Mexican dish and um, I realized that I had corn in a dish, you know, so I put that in there because I had already eaten all the corn. Anyway, and then I had a little kombucha, a little seltzer, because I was feeling like I wanted something a little sweet. And, but, mm, so I, the kombucha was sweet enough. And then I worked and worked and worked. And for the, my dinner tonight, I had, uh, oh man, it was really good. I realized that I had fresh cauliflower that I hadn't eaten yet. In fact, I need to steam it. I'm gonna steam it after I get off here and freeze it. Because it was a big head of cauliflower. So I um, steamed up the cauliflower and I had some beans that I had soaked and cooked for, it took a while to cook, they're pinto beans, but they were really nice and tender when they were done. And I just love beans. I was eating, like taking tablespoons of beans during the day, salted. And um, so I had beans, I put some salsa in there I had my steamed cauliflower, and then I took the, my cheesy sauce, which is not cheese. It's just, you know, non-fat recipe from Chew on Vegan. And I put that into the um, air fryer after um, it had steamed. And then I mixed it all up with the salsa and the beans, and boy, was that a good dinner. That was so good. And um, let's see. And then this evening, you know, it was good because I had my dinner, you know, and I was drinking peppermint tea, and I had had two cups of black tea with lemon and P-Y-U-R-E. That's the sweetener I use in the tea. It's very good. It's low glycemic, theoretically. I think it's xylitol. And um, that gave me some pep because I needed pep. I was really tired in the afternoon. And um, after I meditated and I rested, Quite a while I felt that my pep came back and um, then this evening I was thinking about my fudgy brownies and uh, I think I maybe even had a fudgy brownie today yeah I think I did I had the last one but I was thinking you know you really need to have those in your freezer as you're working because I'll be working a lot in the next let's say five days and uh, so I tonight like I just really quickly, it wasn't all that quick, but you know, as quickly as I could, I, um, in the food processor, I made up oat flour from oatmeal. And actually I realized that I had some oat flour that I wasn't aware of, but um, it worked fine. I uh, put it in the food processor and ground it up. And then I put a uh, mashed banana, applesauce, a flax, um, flax, egg. I didn't have any zucchini. I've used, I have I have worked with all my zucchini, so I did not have any zucchini in the house, but I had frozen zucchini because it calls for shredded zucchini. So I just took the frozen zucchini slices and then just put them in the food processor. You know, I think it'll probably work. And um, what else? I melted some unsweetened baker's chocolate. I had a half a cup of cocoa powder, vanilla, I had my swerve brown sugar, a little, you know, like a quarter of a cup of that. And then I did uh, two thirds of a cup of uh, swerve confectioner sugar. 
and I put a little bit of apple juice in there to sweeten it and um, a little xanthan gum, which I find to be very good in non-fat recipes, baking powder, baking soda, a little bit of salt. And that was about it. And oh yeah, I put some walnuts in there because I like the crunchy kind of, and I think, you know, I've decided that just some nuts is not terrible because I'm, I'm doing very well with my weight. Oh yeah. I also decided that in the end of September, I'm going to do a 10 day juice fast just to knock off the last segment, just get rid of it, of weight that I need, that I want to lose. And, um, so that's a, something I've decided. In 10 days, I should be able to do that without too much difficulty. Although 10 days is a long time. That's what you always realize once you get into it. It's a long time. Anyway, so that's it for day 25. It was a good day. No exercise today. You know, I was sitting here at the desk. But, you know, there are days like that. So anyway, that's my daily wrap-up.